How's it going, everyone? And welcome to another episode of Eric Gets Spanked at Super Expert, because I don't play this game as much as I used to, but it's like riding a bike. You still like it. You don't ever lose it, but you can get just a, just a little rusty, but usually the rust wears off pretty quick. Well, let's go. Super Expert, no skip. I'm scared. A uh, mini Kaizo. Okay. As long as it's just a mini Kaizo, I can do, I can do some Kaizo tricks, but sometimes some people's definition of mini Kaizo is... Uh, a little bit broader than mine, right? I mean, this is super easy. This could be a lot of extra lives too, right? Oh, never mind. I thought it was just going to be straight Goombas, yeah? That's pretty chill. I wonder if I would have needed that. No, you get another one. That's cool. Okay, got another one. Woohoo! Am I going to... Am I going to need this? I mean, you're giving me a shell. I feel like I'm going to need to use it. Oh, boy. A checkpoint. Oh, that's so chill. I'm going to take it with me just in case, yeah? Okay. Oh no! Wait. Uh, <laughs> wait. Where do you want me to go? Is there better be a platform for me? Okay, thank God. I was. Oh, I mean, it was touch and go, but. Oh, chill, chill, chill. Okay, this is this is a mini Kaizo. It's very very easy. Uh ha 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 ha! Lol. You got me. Ha uh, ha ha. <laughs> Please don't kill me. Oh, thank God. No extra lives, though, really? Come on. Come on, in Kaizo, you gotta give the extra lives. Am I gonna die? No. No extra life, though. That's unfortunate. That's, I mean, in Super Expert, beating a level with only minus one life, it's pretty good. Bum -bum. Let's go. Level number two. Now, Pular. Puzzle solving and speed run. That's not a good combo. Have <laughs> not? No, no. Reach the goal without landing. After having left the ground, and I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. That's where I'm supposed to be going. I mean... Okay. I got a POW. And, okay, the POW's gonna counterbalance me. Oh, you son of a... You son of a... Let's just see what the rest of the level's like. I think we we're close to the end, yeah? Oh. Gotta go fast. <laughs> okay, I see how the level goes. <laughs> you gotta go really fast hitting that P. Like, you gotta time that perfectly. That's so weird. I need to, like, go all the way over here and just... There we go. I got it. I got it. I got it. <gasps> but, so I gotta, like, time that and run off of it and go up the slope. You know how hard that is? Like, because I can't fall off this platform, right? I need to actually, like, as I'm falling, I need to start running. Wow. Okay, no, no. That, I mean, that's good, though. I took my time with it. Because if you just fall the tiniest little bit, it's game over, right? No, see? That's not good. You need to run. And I thought that would be good enough to run over the gap, but clearly not. This is insanely hard. I can't believe I didn't lose from having done that. Wow. Yes, I made it. Wow. Why? Why? Why didn't you start running, bro? What did I do differently the one time I got there? I don't get it. Yeah, the Jonah blocks are weird. Like you need to fall off this thing. You need to fall off the seesaw. You need to fall off the seesaw, like, wait, and then run. It's it's so weird. You can't just, like, run right off of it. There, It's so weird. You gotta, like, wait and then run. I don't know. I don't get it. Okay. There, that was good. That was well-timed. Go. You just run right off? Well, I'm glad that's over with. That was frustrating. <laughs> that was not fun. <laughs> the power up challenge. Ooh, yay. Let's power up. Okay. Yeah. So, uh. So, about them power ups, yeah? Let's go. Uh, checkpoint. 
Oh, it's going to be one of these uh, kind of hub areas where we need to get a power up and go through. Okay. Let's go for the star one. Oh, boy. It's in Super Expert, so I imagine I'm going to have to be pretty perfect going through here. Oh, no, Eric. Ah, shoot. Well, I can still salvage this, maybe. <laughs> if I can get to that beetle, wait, the beetle won't get destroyed. Oh, nice. That's cool. Okay. Oh, no, I will destroy it. Yes, nice. Oh! I could have actually didn't done a sp uh, spin jump on top of that if I had run speed. There we go. Nice. Solid. Solid. Oh, I got to get that. <laughs> Wait. What's the difference between the door and the pipe? Is the pipe like a reset? I imagine the pipe's where we got to go. Yeah. But there's no extra checkpoint. Really? No extra checkpoint? Oh, boy. Okay. Let's go. The fire flower challenge. That looks... This looks way chiller than the other one. This is actually a really relaxing level. I might actually be able to live here, leave here with uh, positive lives, yeah? So I think I'm going to need to keep this Fireflower active. There's probably going to be like a check at the end, like with an ice block or something. Um, so we'll see. We'll see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Teabag. You guys are nothing to me. Um... Wait, what? Oh. Oh, I see. It's like a shooting range. Shooting gallery. Let's go. Yeah, there's definitely checks here, right? Okay. Uh, the Fireflower Challenge is a, it's, it's a little more boring than the star one. A little less exciting. Ding dong. Oh, no, molies. Yeah, this is the check right here. Oh, shoot. Come on, shoot, 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 shoot. Get in, get, get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Nice. And now you have to lose the power up. Okay. Pretty cool so far. I'm going to go through the door and see what happens. It better take... I think it's going to be a checkpoint. Yeah, I see. That's neat. But you can get stuck there. Like, if you go through that checkpoint and there's a bunch of breakable blocks, but you don't have, like, a power up. No, no, no. You can't get stuck there. You have to be able to beat the level from the checkpoint. Okay. I'm just... I'm paranoid. All right? I'm paranoid. So, we need to keep... This one looks hard. We're going to have to probably keep this power up because we're going to need to break some, uh... Some blocks later, so... Oh, <laughs> I just choked on my spit because I tried to crouch jump, but I stood up in the middle of the jump. Ha, <laughs> ha. That scared me! And I choked on my spit. This super expert actually physically hurt me. Can you believe it? I'm, I'm physically in pain because of this game. Uh, That's gotta be... That's gotta be a... Oh, never mind. It's a crane. I was gonna say that's gotta be a big jump, but I guess not. Okay. Okay, now that's scary because there's spikes on top. We just got a big jump right here, yep. Okay, that was hard. Kinda. Okay. Medium difficulty. Let's not call it hard. Medium difficulty. Should let's get let's get another checkpoint. Yeah. Oh, I see. There's a donut block on one of these. I didn't even see that donut block. I'm so observant, huh? <laughs> I'm so observant. I didn't see the donut block. That's chill. That's super chill. So now we go into the last one. Which is gonna be a cake. Which could be hard if it's a hard flying section. A little nervous. Oh, I think we just gotta... Okay, so we can't do that. We need to go up and around and... Boom! To that side. We gotta do it again. I mean, it's fun. Why not, right? <laughs> Yay! That's so fun. Oh, boy. Oh, you could... You know what you can do? You can actually, uh... Shit! What you can do is, I think you can use your cape to, like, wave them up there. Is there any way I can still get through here? There's probably going to be a check that I'm going to need the cape for, but, I mean, we got, we got to try, right? Yeah, there's no way. 
This level's really good, actually. The setups are cool. I like it. Okay, so we can uh, spin that up there. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, what was I thinking? Of course, it's like everything to, everything that these power-ups has special is are in these parts. It's really cool. This level's really well made, right? Um. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we going. I think we had to crouch jump there. But I'm not entirely sure. And same with here. I'm not too sure. But I'm crouch jumping anyways, just to be careful. That was... Easier than I thought it was going to be. All right. And just in case. Actually, this is a bad idea. If I get this checkpoint and then I die, what that means is I'm going to lose all my red coins because I lose the key. So getting that's a bad idea. <laughs> Hopefully the level just ends. If there's a wrench thrown into this, like if there's some sort of boss at the end, then I'm not going to be happy about it. Okay. I mean, this is a great level. This is really cool. Yay, let's just go. We already have three extra lives. Don't need to be fancy. All right, so I think we're leaving this level with more lives than we started with, which is good. It was a fun, challenging level. And I left with more lives than I started with. Nice. Remember, six levels is a successful run in my mind. So we are on par. We are, we are well above par for getting there. Or well under par, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Whichever perspective you're thinking from. Okay, this is Jungle Jumble. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. You got to do that in one shot. Otherwise, you're just screwed. Okay, this is good. This is... I'm dead. Do you just jump right away there? Oh! Okay. I can't see what's down below. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. It's a blind jump. This is not good. Runs over, guys. Runs over. Okay. Oh, we tried. Uh, blind jump. I should have gone as far as I could. Okay. Uh, that's a reset door. That's cool. So we need to... Okay, now it's getting a little easier, though, at least. Wait a sec. Are you... Oh, I see. That's cute. I saved... I saved the Yoshi. That's... I earned some... I earned some damn respect with that jump. I sacrificed no Yoshis. You're supposed to sacrifice them, but I didn't. Damn. Checkpoint. Oh, hell yeah. Well, that's very kind. Now, is there any way I'm going to be able to keep the Yoshi? I don't think so. I think the Yoshi's... Yoshi's gotta go, yeah. That's fine. Oh, hey, I wonder if, like... Oh, I was gonna say, I wonder if I'm supposed to go up any of those pipes. Okay. This is... is this is a weird level. Like, a part of me likes it, and a part of me thinks it's just so weird. I don't... I don't know what to think. Like, why? That's a lot of one-ups. That's... That's... I mean, that's nice. Like, what is... Oh, there's, there's red coins in there. Are, maybe uh, The red coins have got to be extra. Okay, I don't think we need the red coins. Oh, shoot. No, no, no. We don't need... Ah! I don't think we need the red coins. Yeah. Or do we? What? No, we don't. We just need to hit that and go through the pipe, yeah? Oh, no. No. Uh, wait, wait, wait. I can go in here and come back in, yeah? And get another power up. Yeah, there's another one I didn't get. Shit! I don't know what I'm. I don't know what I. I don't know what I'm doing. Shit! There's no way to get through there unless I destroy those, right? And the power ups are gone. I think I'm just screwed. I tried really hard. That's okay. We'll lose a life. We get three extra lives for beating this, so we won't have lost that many. Oh, serious? Oh, no. We need to go down. Yeah. Oh! No, no, no. Do not get hit by that. Okay. Now we go up. Yes! yes. Wait, what? 
That's a, it's a, that's a winky face. Did you see that? That's a winky face. Like, no, that's not the answer. So you need to go... What? But you need to... How do you know which key door you need to get into, though? Is the question. Oh, boy. The end is over there. I bet we can get to that flagpole. With the right tools. Yeah, like up here. You can, I bet you can jump on this. And get to... Okay, come on. We're gonna try. Oh! Same shit, dude. Dude, no! I bet we need the uh, other power-up. Yeah. I bet we need this. Let's give that a shot. Let's go. Yeah, that's all you need. Wow. Should have done that to begin with. I didn't realize you got so much more distance with the uh, squirrel outfit, the flying squirrel outfit. That's fine. Lost a few lives, but no big deal. Got three extra lives there. Nighttime stroll. Standard and themed. Sounds chill. Nighttime stroll, right? Oh. Oh. Ooh, yeah, a little precise, huh? Little, I'm not going for that. Okay. Chill. Oh, Magic Koopa. It's fine. Murder it. I like the extra lives. That helps me a lot. Ah, I gotta jump early on that one. So we have enough extra lives. That's nice. Let's go. Ooh, yeah. You gotta jump early. Hopefully there's a checkpoint. Yes. Yeah, I knew it was going to start filling up. That's why I went I went fast. Is it going to keep on coming up though? Oh yeah, it is. Oh yeah, it is. Uh-oh. Am I screwed? No, I don't think... Oh boy. No! Oh, come on! Oh, I wish there was an arrow that showed you. You got you to keep run speed to be able to get that. Or I just wish the screen scrolled up a little bit better. Like, clearly the screen needs to scroll up faster in these games. That was, that's just mean. Like, you can't see what's above you. Just basically comes down to memorization. Okay. Okay, got it. <laughs> oh, no! Kaizo, no. No. No, okay. Whew. Uh oh, are these going to start going like really fast or something? Oh, and then we got to get in here. Okay, that's easy. Nice. Is that going to be it? That was, I mean, that was a fun level. GG, nice. <laughs> Imagine spikes around the end and we die or something. No, that was a very honest level. Let's be real. So we're leaving that level with more lives than we started with. And I enjoyed it a lot. It's just fun, like platforming. Cool. I'm happy with that. Nice. Level number six. If we do this, it's considered a success in my books. Oh, no, no, no. Feel Shell Man section one. This is like a Kaizo practice. It's going to be so ridiculously hard. I'm dead. I'm, I'm it's Jesus. I'm dead. I'm dead. This is like a ridiculously hard Kaizo practice section. Cool. Okay, look at all those X's, right? Yeah, you need to throw the bomb over to the left, and it'll blow up that thing, so it'll blow up the on-off switch so we can continue forward, but... But I don't know what we do with the shell. So yeah, you gotta throw it over there, right? And then you take the shell with you, and then uh, jump over to the right. That's pretty tough. But it takes a while! 
to uh for that bomb to blow up so what the hell like there's no stopping i think you gotta do a shell jump like that no matter what you do it no 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 you gotta keep the shell for later so what you do is like you gotta jump off the on off switch the blue blocks and then you take the shell and you jump on the spring and then you do a shell jump wow i mean it's not really well marked right everything just cut it off of one another it's not really that well marked I have no idea what to do. So this is some guy's practice level for like another like crazy huge Kaizo level, yeah? Okay. I got it! I finally got it! And then I went too far. <laughs> Woo! Why? Why is there a sh I don't understand what that first shell is for. It makes no sense to me. Why? Why? Why is it there? It's there so you can accidentally kick it and you can destroy everything else. That's why it's just there to be annoying. You need to like get it out of the way. It's just there to be annoying. That's it. Ah, uh, yeah, you got to throw them both to the left, like to the left, to the left and then jump over. Okay, excellent. That's a great way to end my super expert run. Okay, so I just took a look at the level feel Shellman, which was a popular is a popular Kaizo level from like a, over a year ago. And it's insanely ridiculously hard. I don't feel like doing it. That would take me so long to learn. It's like, it's really hard. It's stuff that I have not even done in Kaizo. Like it's way above my level. So hope you guys enjoyed this run. Um, it was enjoyable up till, you know, getting stiffed at the last level, but oh well, that's okay. That's just, it just happens sometimes. I will see you guys later. Thanks for all the support. And as always, peace.